everyone, it's Jody back here with Strength and Wisdom Tarot, here to do a random reading for September 8th. Keep in mind that they are random readings, so take what applies and leave the rest. Thank you for everyone who has liked, subscribed, and shared to my channel. Love you guys, you rock! If anyone would like a personal reading with me, all the info will be in the box below. So, let's find a message for somebody out there today. Hopefully more than one. First card that came out. Whoa. I'll take that one. First card that came out is a five of wands. This is petty arguments, babble. Not everybody's on the same page. Could be inner conflict. Second card that wanted to come out is the justice card. Something being rectified. Something being justified. Karmic justice. Count on it. But something being made fair. And the next card is the Five of Cups. And this is mourning the loss. I call it the all is all hope is not lost card. Because if this guy just turned around, he still has two cups left. So, right off the bat, you get these arguments or this, you know, conflict between people. And something needs to be made right. Something needs to be made fair. And of course, with a conjunction of people, somebody's going to feel slighted. But something needs to be made fair. Tip the scales. Now I have the hanging man. And this is someone feeling stuck. Stagnant. Suspended. It's also self-imposed. You can get yourself out the way you put yourself in. It's seeing something in a different perspective. And then we have the Nine of Cups. The Wish Being Fulfilled card. The Yes card to an answer. Or looking for an answer. To a question. Just saying. So something needs to be put right. Ooh, my cards just went flying out once I said that. It's making somebody feel like they're in despair. Maybe like nothing's moving. But somebody needs to take a different look at something. Because once they do, I think that things get made right. Now we have the Four of Wands, and this is taking something to a higher level, excuse me, a commitment. Usually it's the marriage card, and this is going to be right under the Five of Wands. An argument in the home, again, not everyone's, you know, seeing eye to eye. Maybe it is an argument of taking something to a higher level. Whether you're dating, you go exclusive. Or moving in with somebody. Or deepening a bond. And right after that, you get the strength card. And you get strength right under justice. I like it. Okay. I have the Ace of Cups, but it came in reverse. Now, anyone that knows me and watches my videos knows that I start all my decks upright. So, if it comes in reverse, it's meant to be that way. And that's right under the Five of Cups. So, it seems to me that through arguments, possibly in the home or a relationship, going to the next level, whether you're thinking of marriage or just, you know, a deeper commitment in regards to love. That somebody just does not, they're not getting their point across. Somebody doesn't see where somebody's coming from. Somebody needs to see something in a different perspective. Ooh. All right, these ones came out together. So I have the King of uh, Wands. Now here's your fire suit. Your Aries, Ilio, your Sagittarius, or somebody who takes on these properties. 
This is somebody who is motivated. They get things done. They start something to see it all the way to the end. They're creative. They're passionate. Sexy. And that's right under the hanged man. Then, I have the page of pentacles. Pentacles being of the earth suit. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, or somebody who takes all those properties. But more so as a messenger. It's a messenger of having something solid. Something tangible. See, hear, taste, touch, proof. Things that you can believe in. They're solid. And that's right under the wish card. The nine of cups. And then the stray card that came out is the empress. And the empress is sometimes depicted as a Libra or a Taurus. Or she is somebody who can take an idea and birth it into the here and now. Maybe it's pregnancy. But she's divinely led. She's a nurturing person. She's an empress. She rules an empire. That's the straight card. Let's see what's on the bottom of the deck here. Okay. We have the six of wands. And the Six of Wands is the moving away to Kama Waters. Leaving a situation for a better situation. One that's not so turbulent. So it's being thoughts. So maybe somebody here, okay, is just tired of the arguing. And tired of somebody not seeing their point of view. That they're ready to peace out. Could be. So, there we are, you know, with the petty arguments and not being on the same page. And something needs to be rectified, something needs to be justified, something needs to be made fair. Because somebody's hurt. They're hurt out of the situation. It almost makes you feel like somebody is just at the end of the rope. And they just want to throw the towel in. Because they don't feel like they're getting it anywhere. That the situation is stuck. The situation is not progressing. But, if you look at something in a different perspective, come at it at a different point of view. I think somebody's luck will change. A prayer will be answered. A wish will come true. Because this is about stability. This is about a relationship that needs to excel. It needs to go to another level. Where somebody wants somebody to be committed to them. And they want it just to be maybe just two people. And only those two people. Or a deeper understanding of what somebody has in a relationship. And this is going to take strength. It's going to take courage. It's going to take guts. To make this right. Because even though the Ace of Cups, which is the universe's way of giving you an opportunity to see if you take it or not. Just because it's the reverse does not mean it's a bad card. It just means it's delayed. It still can be offered if somebody sees something in a different perspective. <clears throat> I think somebody here is so woe down in despair that they don't see that they still have a fighting chance at this. It can be salvaged. It can be rectified. It can be justified. It's going to turn around. Now we have the King of Wands. The fire suit. Passion. Creative. Getting things done. Putting something in motion. This could be this, the person. With fire like qualities. That somebody is just trying to get their point across to. And the King of Wands here. Is looking right at. The Ace of Cups that is turned upside down. 
it's like he's wondering when it's going to get filled again. Or why it isn't there yet. Right after the king, you have the page. And this is the messenger of bringing something that is believable. Concrete. Something that has value. Worth. And folks, relationships are pinnacles. They are valuable. If you value what you have or the person you have in your life, and this can go both ways, you know, somebody else making that appreciation for somebody. Okay, it's, it's, it's a pinnacle. And at the end of this is the Empress of taking this gift of a relationship, seeing something in a different perspective, perhaps putting your own feelings aside and think about the other person. That might be looking at something in a different perspective, look at it through somebody else's eyes. And I'm thinking that you might get that. All right. I know where they're coming from now. Absolutely, because under the going away to calmer waters, instead of bailing on this situation, let's get somebody stuck in their head. Somebody who's not getting their happiness. Something needs to be seen in a different light. So let's break it down. The conflicts about this relationship, about this beginning, about this deepening bond calls for somebody to make right a situation and this is going to take guts, this is going to take courage to make something right because somebody is missing a love they once had but it's still there it's still there. And maybe when you take a different point of view about this person, or it's this person that needs to take a different point of view, look at something at a different angle. They will see that they have something very valuable. And it is a wish come true. If they could just manifest this, be the nurturing person, come at a different angle and create this and bring it to the here and now. Excel this. It's totally possible. Somebody definitely needs to take something into consideration, another person, their feelings or whatnot. Look at it at a different point of view and things will turn around for you. So that is what I have for you. Please keep on liking, subscribing, and sharing to my channel, and I will see everybody back real soon. Take care.